These videos scare us and make us think that could our moon ever collide with our earth? How dangerous it would be? Will life on our earth vanish? Many such questions come in our mind because imagination has no end. Moonfall is unimaginable event, but if it collides with our planet, then it can destroy entire earth. Well, the point is, can this really happen? Stay connected till the end of this video because you will learn a lot about the truth of moonfall today. Moonfall is a terrible event, but it can never be possible because there are two reasons behind that. First is Roche limit and second is our Earth's gravity. These two factors protect us from this event. So first, we discuss about Roche limit. Friends, every planet has its Roche limit. It is a ledge or a boundary that protects us from the celestial objects of space. It is the minimum distance in which a large satellite or space object can approach its primary body without being torn apart by tidal forces. So, if a celestial body comes in or near the boundary, it will disintegrate because the first body's tidal forces exceed the second body's gravitational self-attraction. Inside the Roche limit, orbiting material will tend to disappear and form rings and outside this limit, it will tend to form a new celestial body or moon. Roche limit's distance depend on the densities of two bodies. The Roche limit of moon to earth is 18,470 kilometers. So, if moon will come within 18,470 kilometers, it will turn apart and become a ring of earth before fall. Another fact is, the moon is going far away from us. Yes, our moon is going away at the rate of 3.78 centimeters per year. Now the second reason is our earth's gravity that protects us from moonfall. Yes, because of earth's gravity, moon never hit us. Well, how this is possible? Because gravity pull everything, but why not moon? Let me explain with an example. Take a bucket and pour some water in it. Now try to spin the bucket in circle with your arm over your head. Did you notice something strange? How the water is not falling on the ground? This is because the gravity is being wiped out by the inertia that you are rotating the bucket faster. This inertia pushes the water and the bucket away from you. So, when you push the bucket over you, Earth's gravity pulls the water away. But, inertia pushes the water up. In this way, when we turn the bucket round, the water doesn't fall on you due to the inertia. Note that if you don't spin it fast enough, the water falls on you. For instance, a bucket of water is the moon and you are the Earth. So, when Earth's gravity pulls the moon, the rotation of the moon balances the orbit. But if the moon slows down the movement, it can fall over you. These are two reasons which not only save us from the moon but also from many other space objects. See how stable is everything here to stay. The balance of the moon's orbit, the rotation and the orbit of our planet, everything here is just perfect for us. We should be thankful for everything. So if you have any queries about this, let me know in the comment section. And if you like this video, so feel free and subscribe our channel for more updates of the universe. And one more thing, thank you for supporting, thanks for watching.